desire without knowledge is not good. How much more will hasty feet miss the way, miss the target? Have you ever felt that you have been in that kind of position? A person's own folly leads to their ruin, yet their heart rages against the Lord. Oof, rushing into something, rushing into something, and then when there is a trouble, I blame, I'm angry with, with the Lord. Why, why, where are you, Lord? What are you doing, you know? When I look at my years when I was much younger, that was me. That was me. And I know that I've been praying many times and I still pray when I remember certain things. Lord, why? Why is this emotional maturity always running late? When, when I needed it when I was 17, 18, 19, 20, when I needed it, it wasn't there. I didn't hear it, I didn't see it, or I didn't want to see it. Or even if maybe parents and the others were advising me, it ran over my ears. Do you know where this is often seen? People are in a relationship. They break a relationship. They think that breaking a relationship doesn't have this, that you need the same process as if almost you have gone through divorce. They're rushing into new relationship to heal themselves from the previous relationship. And this is the recipe for, this, for, for a really uh, ruin. Relationship is broken, instead of allowing himself or herself some time to back off, to reflect and to think and to assess where I am. Immediately the next week or two weeks later or three weeks, I don't know, maybe, you know, they are in a new relationship. Why? Because they think that this new relationship is going to help them to get rid of all whatever baggage from the first. And it never happens because you carry the mess into new relationship. It's the same applies in a, in a marriage. You are married, you get divorced, the next day you are married again. Believe me, your wife will not love you for that because you will bring the baggage from your first marriage into the second one, almost 100% sure. This is just one illustration of rushing without wisdom, rushing without wisdom and then having to deal with consequences, not necessarily only you, but maybe some others too.